Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Danielle. Today, I'm so excited. We are going to be listening to Sabrina Carpenter singing Please, Please, Please in the live lounge. Now, this is not the first time I've listened to Sabrina Carpenter, okay? There are many songs that I've listened to her, so there'll be somewhere up here in the corner that you can go look at the whole playlist that I've done of her, but I haven't done any of her recent things, and this is actually something that my Patreons exclusively voted on, so make sure that if you're not a part of the Patreon family, you go ahead and check it out so you can also be a part of the exclusive polls that we take there on Patreon. Also, if you have a specific song request that you would like me to react to, there's going to be a link down in the description below that you can go ahead and request your favorite song, and I'll get that to you in 30 days or less. Might even have the chance to make it on the YouTube channel. So let's go ahead and take a listen to Please, Please, Please. I'm super interested to hear how she does this live because of course I've heard this song. Come on, are you living under a rock if you haven't heard this song? I've heard most of the songs I feel like that are on the album, but I think we should do a full album review. I don't know, let me know, patrons, if you want me to do a full album. Mm, the bass is so good. I love her style of music, it is so fun. Judgment, I know I have good taste. It's funny and it's ironic, but only I feel that way. I promise them that you're different, and everyone makes mistakes. But just how does she sound better live? I don't understand. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Like, I know I have good judgment, I know I have good taste. Her tone is incredible. different and everyone makes mistakes but just don't I heard that you're an actor so act like a stand-up guy whatever devil's inside you don't let them out tonight I tell them it's just your culture and everyone rolls their eyes yeah I know she's so oh, good asking, baby Her placement on these pleases too is amazing. I feel like when she sings it live, it's a little bit more mixed. And when she sings it on the album, it's a little bit more head voicey, more airy. Let's go ahead and take a listen back just a little bit. Oh, I'm asking, baby. much more mixed. Please, please, please. Rather than that really airy sound that I feel like she has on the album. And I like when she pushes it a little bit more in that mix. I feel like it sounds super strong and, but also angelic at the same time. Like she does a really good job with her mix. Don't bring me the tears when I just did my makeup so Listen to that pull down she does too on another. You can tell right there that she's using the rest of her breath there because she's really, you can hear like the squeeze that she's doing. And then takes a big breath. My ego's another, I beg you don't. She's like squeezing the rest of her air out there. There's me like the others. Like the other, like the other. Do you see what I'm saying about her range? Like, hello. Like the other. Hold, please. Like the other. And then. No, it's not that high. Okay. High E. Okay. But still, I mean. Like the other. 
Uh, that's just low. I mean, it's a good range. So high, so good. Fan is so nice. <laughs> we could live so happily if no one knows they're here with me. I'm just kidding. Really, really, really. Please, please, please don't burn Okay, also, these background singers sound identical to the track, so I'm kind of wondering if she's singing live and the BGVs are not singing live. Unless they're just that good, because, do you know what I'm saying? It sounds exactly the same. Please, please don't I mean, to a T. You know what also could be happening? They could also have the backing track that's in there. And if you're unfamiliar with this, when singers sing, there is some kind of track that happens underneath that is very artificial. Not in the fact that it's like, it's fake, but artificial as in like, you can tell that it's not an instrument that's playing it. It is some kind of computer right like a computerized sound. And you can tell that that is being played here, which that happens in a lot of live versions of songs so i'm wondering if the bgvs are on the track still and the bgvs are also singing live to make it feel a little bit more full she's definitely singing live you can hear the different inflections in her voice but i'm curious because the bgvs just sound really identical to the track <laughs> Opt up. Sabrina's range is honestly insane. I'm sure you guys sing along with her when you're singing. She has a really low alto and she has a very high soprano. Like I think, what song is it that is just so high that you're like, oh my gosh, I think it's Juno. And I feel like when we reacted to her like years ago, I was like, this girl is so underrated. Like why don't people know more about her? Now here she is. Everybody gets it. <laughs> Hold on, I want to hear that one more time. Do it in front of me. Do it in front of me. She kind of pulls that down. Do it in front of me. I like that. That change up is really nice. You want to go and be stupid? Don't do it in front of me. It's a nice switch up because it brings it down into her alto really rich and strong from that like really airy head voice that's happening because this song is very high and bright the whole time and then to bring it down into those parts where we're not expecting it to come down it's very refreshing. You don't want a part of my music make me hate you I didn't know that she ever sang that. I thought that was just the BGVs. Ah, that was so good. Okay, this was so fun to hear Sabrina Carpenter sing live. I feel like I haven't heard her sing a full song live in a long, long time. Obviously, a lot of us are watching probably on TikTok and Instagram her short and sweet, is it short and sweet? Short and sweet tour that's happening right now, which is so fun to see just how much fun she's having. I love how relaxed she is, not just 
as a person, but as a singer, you can really hear that come out through this performance here on this Please 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 in the Live Lounge. Just, she's so chill. Her facial structure as she's singing is just always relaxed. Like there's never tension in her voice or in her jaw. You can watch and she is just chill the whole time. And that really comes through, I feel like, as a person too. She's just a chill person. These notes that she has, I mean, Sabrina has literally such an incredible range. Like, like the other, that's low. I'm a soprano. I mean, I feel like she's a soprano, but she's also like a really low alto. <laughs> it's low for me. Try to sing it. Like the other time. Like that is low as a soprano to sing. It's fun. She helps me to strengthen my range singing her songs. It's very exciting. So thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope that you enjoyed it. And just a reminder, if you're not a part of the Patreon, make sure to become a part of our Patreon family. We have extended versions of all of my reactions on Patreon. So if you wanna see an extended breakdown and version of this song, head over to my Patreon and become a part of our Patreon family. And also if you have a specific song request that you would like me to react to, you can go ahead and head down to the link in the description and I will get that reaction to you in 30 days or less and you might even have the chance to be on the YouTube channel. So thank you guys so much for watching with me and I'll see you next time. Bye.